Hey, what's going on guys? Agitated here, back again with another video. This one's going to be a little different for those of you who are new subscribers. By the way, thank you so much for uh, all the love on the recent videos, especially the Dokkan ones. I was very surprised to see how well they did, uh, but I greatly appreciate it. I'm super happy to know that uh, I can make Dokkan content and people will actually want to watch it. So uh, I might try and go ahead and do that. But today's video is actually on uh, MLB The Show 2023, baby. Uh, for those of you who didn't know, as I was saying earlier, you know, new subscribers, maybe you haven't checked out some of my older videos, I am a huge baseball nerd. Uh, I love baseball. It's my favorite sport easily. Uh, and if you didn't already know, uh, opening day is March 30th. The game actually released today, March 28th. So I am super ecstatic and excited about it. Uh, for those of you who are about to ask, I'm not a big Diamond Dynasty guy anymore or uh, online play. I might play my friends here and there. But uh, the thing I really love is, much like the Madden had my play or whatever they called it, I forget exactly, uh, we have Road to the Show, which is, I think, one of the best just, like, personal experiences when it comes to, like, putting yourself in the game or in the shoes of a player. Um, I love it a lot. I've loved it for a long time. Uh, but for the positions that I actually played in person... I'm not going to be able to pick those this year because uh, another thing that you might not know, or for those of you who haven't seen my videos, uh, I'm a huge Baltimore Orioles fan, so positions I normally play would be first base, third, or uh, right field, and all of those positions are currently occupied by players that I actually like, um, as well as the DH role, so... Uh, I don't really want to kick those guys out of their roles. My goal is, you know, hopefully that I can go up quick enough to actually play with them. Because of that, I'm going to have to go ahead and uh, pick one that I don't normally play or, like, care about. Um, the thing is that I pretty much care about every single position on the field except for one. And that's the one we're going to be picking. I've never actually played it. I don't even know if it's exciting, to be honest. Um, I actually wanted to play catcher this year, but uh, I'm not going to do that. I I'm not going to replace Adley. I'll literally get traded. Probably the computer will kick me off somewhere else. But either way, we're going to go ahead and uh, start my road to the show. This is going to be the first episode. I'm not entirely sure how often I'm going to upload these. I might just upload them every now and again, like maybe once every other day or you know, once a week and just kind of have like a little mishmash of uh, everything that's been going on in games, cool stuff that's been happening because I have done a full playthrough of all 162 games and I gotta say that was a lot of work to upload. Uh, it was just like a lot, like it was just over and over and over and over again and it just got kind of exhausting. So I'm probably going to do a little more condensed, like highlight reel kind of vibe this time, but uh figured we go ahead for this first episode and actually just have it be pretty raw, just see all the new, like, intros or whatever they might do. I don't know if actually if they're going to do any new intro cinematics or maybe, like, new talk show radio host, uh, like, snippets and all that with, uh, like, Carlos Pena, Ken Griffey and all that. But either way, figured we would share this experience together for the first time. So this is going to be my Orioles Road of the Show playthrough. If you guys are interested, want to stick around and see how it goes, maybe drop a like on the video and uh, hit that subscribe button. And comment down below what your favorite baseball team is and uh, why. But uh, yeah, my name's Adjit. Let's go ahead and let's get into it. Got a new intro kind of little thing. I don't remember it ever doing that in the show 22. Pretty sure it never did. Start your... Oh, they actually like let you. Oh, okay, that's cool. No. Okay, I'll just do current. Position player, two-way, or only pitcher. Uh, <laughs> I like how they have, like, Babe Ruth or uh, Shohei Otani. That's, that's actually kind of funny. Um, I have traditionally done a two-way player for the past two, three games. Uh, and I got to say I'm a little tired of pitching, to be honest. Um like, it's fun. I just don't feel the need to really do it as much anymore. So I'm actually going to go ahead and just uh, be strictly position player this year. Because, as I was saying, I wanted to um, intentionally make sure that I didn't take up any roster space. I guess, I think in this game, they did make it possible for you to actually be a DH strictly. But uh, as I was saying earlier, I don't actually want to take the DH spot either. Um, because I think Uran Urias is currently listed as that on the roster. 
So don't really want to take that away from him. Um, so with that in mind, we're going to go ahead and I'm just going to have to be something else. Ah, what do I want to focus on? I was going to say, about the Ed Nolan. What do I want to do? Power, fielding. Type. That's going to really lock me in then. In all honesty, yeah, we're going to do power. Because let's be honest, hitting home runs is the most fun in this game anyway. Now, there's only one position that I can be on the Baltimore Orioles. Sorry, Adam Frazier. Oh, sorry. I, yep. We're not going to talk about that. Oh, okay. Uh, I guess we'll go ahead and try this and uh, see how it goes. Because I actually have the companion app downloaded already. I don't know. I'll, I'll give it a try. He's been waiting a long time. And it looks like he's going to get that call. Getting drafted is a dream come true. You now have the opportunity to play in the major leagues. You're in a major league system. Hard work and preparation, you can climb the ladder. You have to ask yourself, are you willing to do what it takes to battle every day, to get the job done, to get your team over the top? And this game has turned upside down! Are you willing to take that chance? A perfect game. Oh, I can't wait. You talk about a guy who comes much advertised. This is it. I am roaring to go. Let's watch. When you hear about certain people who have potential, have great potential, and they go out there every day and prove it, you bet I'll be watching. We might be watching generational talent. The journey begins now. With the MLB draft already underway, a young prospect gets a call from an experienced scout. Alright, so just right off the rip, I get to pick my own player. Uh, if you couldn't tell, it's been a while uh, since I recorded that first part. I uh, kind of just got mad. I couldn't figure out how to do the face scan. Turns out you actually can't on iOS right now. For whatever reason, they just... It just won't let you. Um, I don't really know why. Uh, I don't know. I guess like Apple won't let... And will be the show update their um, app right now. So if you have an Android, or I guess even like a Windows phone, I don't know if it's on the other, or whatever the hell the other phones are, um, you can use uh, FaceCam. But if you're on iOS, you can't right now because they won't let them update the app. Apple will not let and will be the show update on the App Store. So uh, I spent like 30 minutes trying to figure that out, discovered that you couldn't. Got pretty mad, and then I just decided to play Warzone. Uh, but yeah, here we are now. About uh, six hours later. Um, but uh, yeah. If you can't tell already, as I said earlier, I am. Uh, your great player may think you'd be an asset. Uh, what's your future look like? Whether you're on our team or another. <laughs> Let's be arrogant. <laughs> Let's be arrogant. Let's go to the draft. All right, so I'm glad that they changed the animations. I was a little worried that they wouldn't change them at all, but they did, so thank God. Oh, we actually have, like, the real draft animations, too. Cool. Okay, that's new. What? You must be kidding. What? They drafted who? We had this circus last year. All right. So we are ready to go. Uh, that was pretty much right into it. Oh, I like the, the UI looks a little prettier, actually. I'm a fan of that. Go ahead and do my first save, and uh, then I guess we'll just... Go ahead and go from there. Uh, yeah, we're going to start in Bowie as well. Whatever, let's go ahead and get into it. Uh, this is going to be our first big league game. Let's see how it goes. <clears throat> okay, so I just forgot to uh, <clears throat> have my microphone on for our first game. 
Uh, that's super awkward. Uh, but uh, nonetheless, we are going to uh, continue on. Um, I did not mean to uh, to do what I did, but alas, there is a uh, not much to do about it. It was muted, so it's fine. To be completely honest, I went 0 for 5. First at bat. So, um, it takes a lot of pressure off of it. The first time stepping into the Oakland Coliseum, I was nervous. You know, I'm facing Dave Stewart. You know, I faced him one time in spring training prior to that, and um, now everything that you dreamed about, you know, being in the big leagues, being in the show, uh, you know, I walk up there as second hitter and I'm looking like, oh my, I'm finally here. And he could have rolled a ball and probably swung at it. All right. Mike is for sure unmuted. Let's go ahead and do this. We've got uh, Bruce Zimmerman on the mound. First game. Woo! Live from a place that has quite the reputation, Shippen Stadium. Opening day baseball on the show. It's the Bowie Bay Sox and the Hartford Yard Goats. That guy's got an ugly do, bro. First pitch coming your way next. Just about set to go. And today's starting pitcher, Michael Baer. What do we need to know here? Well, he doesn't have overpowering stuff. The easiest thing for him is to trust that catcher. Whatever fingers he puts down, you nod the head. And, and number nine. Kind of a throwback. No batting gloves. Not on purpose. I want a batting gloves game. You literally just won't give it to me. Good take. Maybe losing command a little bit after the walk. Next pitch, not even close. Honestly, I kind of wish that. Uh... The base runner at first with one out. Next one. I kind of wish that the thing that says "good take" you actually can't see it on stream right now, like where you get like the plus or minus for your stats. It used to be in the middle of the. The batter box thing. I kind of wish it was still, to be honest. I'm not a fan that it's not. Next pitch has popped up. Brick. Drifts towards it. Pulls it down and he makes the I honestly catch. thought that slider was going to move more. Which was, Boy, was a my mistake. Yeah, I know it was a hanging breaking Number ball. Number nine will hit next. Over one so far. And here it comes. And that one wrapped foul. One was rap foul, you are correct. Next pitch misses, and a count even one and one. The Bay Sox hitless <sighs> are in the game. Damn, really? That's hard to roped it, line. but he's gonna catch it. Yeah. Makes the grab oh, I actually nubbed it a little bit, apparently. Huh. Wow. He was all over that fast. And stepping in is the speedy one. I actually thought I was going to crank that. Bruce and there he goes. Up. Pitch in for a strike. Throw to second. Great jump. And that is a stolen base. I just realized I'll actually get to feel the steals now. That's going to be fun. I've never actually done that in real life. I never played second base, so. The pitch. Right side. Oh, he, oh, he loves it. Yeah, look at me go. Whatever, man. All right, this is going to be rough for a while. That's okay. Don't take me a while to figure it out. On the ground, right side. And that chance handled. Jesus. Oh, it's coming to me again, baby. So two down. Juan Guerrero, the next to hit. To the right side. Tosses to first. And that, that guy's is fast. No runs, one hit, no errors, and a man left. Seventh inning coming up. All tied up.
Seventh inning tied. Here's the second baseman. Alrighty, baby. See if he can finally perform. Spoiler alert, there's no way I do. There's not much to do with 60 stats. Like, this is really not. Oh, God, this guy's just too speed. Oh, crap. He's a dead hit pitcher. I mean, unless I get something I like. Jim Coffin. Oh, yeah, because the clutch replaces contact now. That's so aggravating. Good job. Like, I like it when I swing at pitches that are quite literally so far away. I cannot even imagine it. Next offering way off the plate. Good spot for the hitter. Definitely has the advantage in this count with runners on. Look for him to be aggressive on this next pitch. Next one is off the plate. Ball three. This is a really good feeling for a hitter. At this point in the ball game, you know that they don't want to walk you. <laughs> you get a pitch to hit. You just better not miss it. I mean, like that one right there. Oh. Oh! And that eats him up. The relay. Woo! And they take the lead. Bro, I just hit a ball so f hard. He might want to keep that ball for a souvenir. I literally hit it and like ran up the second baseman's chest apparently. I see what you're meaning about the uh the errors, Channing. Hopefully keep moving up the ranks towards reaching the big leagues. That's the ultimate goal for him at this I point. did not deserve it. Like, I laced that ball, but I laced it right at second. So, like, I'm surprised I got that. Josh Lester. Don't be surprised to ball on the ground to the corners that they come home with the baseball instead of going to first base. And that'll load the bases. Well, I probably only have on action pitches right now, don't I? Yeah. In this ball game, trying to keep things close. They've been in a difficult spot, and things aren't getting any easier. The pitch. Grounded to third, could be two. He fires home for one. Out of That's the worst one. double play you can commit, dude. Here's the left fielder, Robert Neustrom. One for three. And they're all loaded up. <laughs> Focus on the mound right there. Pretty much gifted him first. We got Zach Watson. Two outs, bases full. And now here's a speed threat. Outfielder number 11. We'll check this out. Drop, 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 drop. Damn it. Hannah puts the squeeze on that one. And that is that. And now here's Hunter Goodman. He's already homered here in this one. The one one mm. hit on the ground might be two. Goes to second for one. And Ooh, I turned my first double play. That is two not at the uh, is not the normal one. And that it is a weird feeling to go and turn a double play. One down. And here oh, is oh, number oh. nine. Oh, it's like everyone else is in slow motion and he's in full speed. And he asks for time now. Chance to take a breath with the bases loaded. <laughs> I dropped my PCI so well, didn't I? And prevent that run from scoring. The pitch. And fouled off. Oh. I nailed that. I was just a smidge late. I power swing it too. I was going to gap that bitch. And the pitch. No! I missed a knuckle curve up in the zone! Oh god, it's so f foul! But it's so far. That was it. No. The pitch. That one missed. One run game here at the top of the ninth. And that one is left. Oh. 
I hit a sack fly at least. Should be more than enough to hit a sack fly. Yeah, there you go. Alright, there's our insurance run. We'll take that, baby. And they lead by two. Sometimes all you got to do is your job and don't overcomplicate things. Keep it simple. Right or third, less than two. There we go, baby. What we got? Two for four or two for, or one for four? One for four. Good old one for four. That's not bad. That's not bad. That's not bad. That's not bad. We take that. We take that. We take that. We can access your statistics. Blah, 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 blah. Yay. We got our first at bats. Got our first hit. Got our first ribby. Did we get our first ribby? Oh, that was the first ribby right there. Yeah. We will take that. Not bad at all. Not bad at all. I mean, these are literally all the same voice lines. Like, I'm sorry, I'm not going to listen to it. I don't care. Okay, yeah, you have two rubies. For him, usually centers around his ability to command all four of his pitches. I mean, he can get by with three. but it becomes a little tougher to keep hitters guessing. I don't like that I can't just see the quirks anymore by hitting left, right on the D-pad. I remember Legend being harder, to be honest. I mean, I am a double A, but like... Yeah, there's a ball. Pretty easy to give up on that pitch right there. Started on the edge of the plate with the spin. You know it's going to finish well off the plate. And that's just foul. So far out in front of that ball. And a pitch. Oh my god. He's begging. Give me that pitch one more time. A hanging changeup just out in front. Two outs. Cuts and misses. It's a strike. I don't want to talk about it. I hit power swing and I knew I shouldn't have, but I'd already committed. That's the second baseman. Number nine. He's over one. And the first pitch misses for ball one. I power swing it, I was late, wasn't I? Where'd it go? Was that, was that that far away? Was I late? Oh, I just, I just flat out missed it, yeah, because I tried to power swing like a dummy. Got under it. Has this one sized up? And makes the play, and that's out. I have an idiot. That's what I get. Home hand. Go ahead, run on base. Now with the plate, number nine. Yeah, I've been doing pretty rough, to say the least. The other way makes the Saw that coming. That's usually my favorite place to hit balls, to too. I can't believe I was actually late on that, to be honest. Levine. I wonder if I just try to uh, inside out it. One. On the ground, right side. Tosses Ooh. to first, and that's one out as they get the leadoff hitter in the sixth. Base is empty with two away. Zach Bean getting ready to hit. <laughs> Bunting for hit, Lester. And yeah, they put the tag on him. That's the third out. Here's the second baseman, number nine. Oh, he's got a sinker. This is going to suck. And by suck, I mean, I don't know how I over-adjusted my PCI that much. I didn't. I shouldn't have. Make any contact, though. Power I got to stop power swinging. I just straight up missed that, didn't I? In the dirt, but kept close. No advance. Good job behind the dish. And the right hander deals. And that one is lifted in the air. Veen gets under it. Brings it in. This for the sucks. Third out. I forgot how annoying it is now. I have like diamond equipment one and shit. One left. Oh, well. in inning number seven, and it's time to stretch. Yay! I'm gonna go for four. This is just not exhilarating to be honest. Hello and welcome.
welcome. Thanks for joining us. Today, the finale of this three game week. Today, the finale. Just about set to go down. And on the mound today, Nick Garcia. What do you got on him, Chris? Well, just a three pitch mix in his arsenal, which, you know, it's not a lot for a starter. So always very important for him to have a good feel and command all three. Sometimes you can make that three look like four if you add or subtract a little bit of velocity on one. But, you know, one thing about it, it can be I easy. I didn't swing at that, but sure. The mound. So hitters are aware of that. Mixing those three pitches at all counts is going to be a big key for him in this one. Yep. Oh, and he hit him. He had two strikes on him, and he hit him. Two on, one out. And next will be the cleanup hitter, Josh Lester. Swing and a ball lifted in the air, shallow left field, and that'll get down for a hit. And that's the second out of the inning on the force play. And here's the first baseman. I don't even know how to feel about that. Like, if that's real life, like, you obviously have far more control and reaction. Like, that's not that hard to, like, just immediately push off your left foot and go back. Whatever, I'm probably just going to buy some diamond equipment like I did last year. It just makes it way more fun off the road. Double play ball to second. There's one. And that's two. First and second. No outs. Now it's the second baseman, number nine. And misses at oh the no, offering. he swings and misses at the initial offering. Who would have thought that happened? <sighs> Left hand hitter waits. In the air, right field. Veen gets under it. Good God, man, seriously? Drops into the glove. Runner tagging for third. Boswell with a relay throw, and he's safe. Yay. So it's first and third. Digging in, Jameson Hanna. It's kind of blows chunks, to be honest. To the right side. And that one handled. Over to first. And he's out. Oh, well, he's doing a nice job of keeping the ball out of the air. Let's the defense work behind him with another ground ball. Good execution. Come on, baby. To the right side. Into the outfield base hit. And that keeps the inning alive. He was all over that one. Not much to this one other than just a willingness to go the other way and put the ball in play. That's a team at bat right there. Nice job of staying back and letting the ball get deep. And now they got some speed on first, so we'll see if they try to get him into motion. Whips it across, and that's the inning. Through four, still tied. Zip, zip. Set for the top of the sixth. Leading off, number nine. Number nine. Garcia, 23 years old. And he was a third round pick in 2020. First offering misses badly for ball one. Hmm, that's actually already lined. Interesting. <laughs> Surprising. And a foul ball. And the pitch. I honestly don't know how I'm that far out in front of those balls. There we go. And a base hit up the middle. I hate that animation. It is so stupid, man. Just have them round the bases comfortably, for God's sakes. The O2. He just flat out missed that. Well, he didn't get the call on the mound to pitch before. Felt like he should have been looking, I think. But the you know, that's oh, good composure right there. He found a way to come back with another good pitch. Checks over to first. Back safely. The pitch. In the air, left side. Guerrero turns to the right on the move. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out. And there are two outs. The batter, the left fielder, Robert Newstrom. Robert Newstrom digs in now. Come on, big guy. Pass and misses. It's a 
Now this is minor league baseball. Woo! Is, did Spencer start this game? No idea if Spencer started this game or not. Swing and a pop up. Number nine, under it. And there's two away. Now batting. So two away with nobody on. Now here is number nine. Now high fly. Ball. I power swung it. I don't know. I clearly didn't get enough of it. Oh. Oh, I'm going three. Not stopping. He's going for three. I'm so out. No! That guy had a cannon, honestly. He was already in scoring position. You gotta hold up right there unless you're absolutely sure. The defense says thank you very much as they head back into the dugout. I actually might have been safe. Two outs. <laughs> I, I might have been safe there. <laughs> In plenty of time to first and it's weird to play it. it's the night and we are tied oh god the fan cam is freaky I don't like the fan cam guys Juan Guerrero the next to hit corner infielders guarding the lines trying to prevent extra bases to third and that one handled to second there's one not in time at first it's a fielder's choice oh i know what third base is on there the lines on the corners late in the ball game like this position perfectly number nine will hit next number nine. Uh. this is kind of a tough matchup as a left-handed hitter facing a left-handed pitcher what there you tell yourself ah. is to stay oh. square to the plate try to hit the ball over the shortstop's right head <laughs> Well, it's kind of deflating. You blow that lead in the bottom of the ninth, so here's a new Yeah, it is very deflating. But try to get some more runs and then close it out in the bottom half of this one. First pitch, not close. Two down, go ahead, run in scoring position. That one pushed foul. I didn't expect it to tail like it did, to be honest. I was not expecting a two seamer there. I thought he was going to go four seam. I wonder where it thinks my PC. Oh, I just. Oh. Okay. I clearly just have more time to react than I think I do. Alright, well, that's gonna be the first series and the first episode of this. Uh, I'm gonna go buy a bunch of diamond equipment because. I don't know, I just want to, to be honest. It's more fun with it, so, like, whatever. Anyway, it's been Agit. If you guys want to see more content like this, more MLB shows, the show, road to the show content, make sure you hit subscribe, drop a like if you enjoyed it, and uh, comment down below what your favorite team is. But uh, yeah, it's been Agit. Peace, y'all. See you in the next one.